is so much at stake in this election. I don't need to tell you. Every single one of you who came out for me, who worked so many hours from my young organizers with energy and passion. <laughs> to the families and friends across this state, I am deeply grateful. Well, I, I love all of you. But here's what I want you to know. It is rare, it is rare that we have the opportunity we do now to have a real contest of ideas, to really think hard about what the Democratic Party stands for and what we want the future of our country to look like if we do our part to build it. I am a progressive who gets things done for people. I am honored to stand in the long line of American reformers who make up our minds that the status quo is not good enough, that standing still is not an option, and that brings people together to find ways forward that will improve the lives of Americans. I look back over the years of my involvement from that very first job I had at the Children's Defense Fund, and I know I know what we are capable of doing. I know we can create more good paying jobs and raise incomes for hardworking Americans again. I know that we can finish the job of universal health care coverage for every single man, woman, and child. I know, I know we can combat climate change and be the clean energy superpower of the 21st century. I congratulate my esteemed friends and opponents. I wish Governor O'Malley the very best. He's a great public servant who has served Maryland and our country. And I am excited about really getting into the debate with Senator Sanders about the best way forward to fight for us and America.